The phenomena of crystallization finds vast application in the manufacture of pharmaceutical ingredients. Let's take a closer look. Crystallization is a kind of solid formation where atoms or molecules arrange themselves in highly organized lattice structures through a process called nucleation, usually under high pressure or low temperature. So carbon atoms form diamond crystals at high pressure and water molecules crystallizes to ice at low temperatures. Crystallization can also occur in a solution. For example, at high concentrations and low temperatures, sugar in solution can crystallize to form rock candy or mystery. To understand solution crystallization better, let's plot temperature of a solution like sugar in water against concentration of the solute. This is the solubility curve. Choose the limits of solubility. For example, at room temperature, a maximum of 180 mg of sugar can dissolve in 100 ml of water. Within the solubility curve, the solution is stable or unsaturated, which means in this zone, you can add more sugar to the solution and it'll dissolve. Beyond the solubility curve is the saturated or metastable zone. Any more solute that's added doesn't dissolve in the solution but it doesn't readily nucleate and form crystals either until it reaches the metastable limit. Beyond this, the solution is super saturated and unstable. In this zone, the solute nucleates rapidly and forms crystals. To push a solution into the super saturated zone, you can reduce the temperature of the solution or add more solute to increase the concentration. This latter process is called seeding and is frequently used in the pharmaceutical industry to crystallize APIs in a solution.